Welcome to CalCast, your creator and national podcast. To another episode of CalCast, your Creator International podcast, a podcast that tells you all about uh, how media and the arts are being used for missions today. Uh, we're going to start a series that is new that will be looking at what Creator International is doing in the nations uh, using arts and media. And what we're going to be doing is trying something new. We're actually going to go through the office at the Creator National headquarters in Australia, and we will be meeting all of the different young people that are working on projects and using their art and their media skills to reach the nations. And so we're going to go through and meet each one of those young people, and uh, they'll tell you a little bit about what they're doing, uh, who they are, and how they hope their art will be used to reach unreached peoples around the world. So we're going to start that cast, and it will be a vidcast, and I hope you will enjoy it. At the end of this podcast, we're going to be playing some really great music, some beautiful music made by a friend of mine who is in Youth with the Mission, and the information about him will be in the show notes for you to take a look at. But before we do, we have uh, some very important promotional information to give you. We want to remind all of our great faithful listeners to our podcast that we do have a website that has all kinds of fabulous prizes on it. It has gifts. It has all kinds of resources that you can get. It has hot links to other really good websites and other resources. And it also has our show notes for all of our episodes. So please do visit our website. We found that a number of our subscribers and listeners aren't actually going to our website and taking advantage of all these great resources. So please do. You'll find that website at www.created.podomatic.com. And you'll find on the left-hand side of the page all of our show notes and all of our episodes. And on each one of those, you're actually able to press a button and play and watch and listen to that particular episode. You're able to look at hot links that are uh, on the show notes there. And you're also able to place a comment after you've listened to that podcast. So please do put comments on the website after you've listened to our podcast episodes. It really helps us and helps others to know what that episode was like for them. Also on the right-hand side of the page, you'll find some hot links that you can just simply click on to send us an email. Our email address is created at podomatic.com, created at podomatic.com. And you can just simply on the right-hand side of the page, click that hot link and it'll open up your email program and you can send us an email. Also, there's a hot link for joining our mailing list. So if you're wanting to get all of our news and all of the latest uh, information about our podcast episodes, you're able to actually just click that hot link and join our mailing list. Also, if you're in the U.S., you can make a phone call to us. Uh, it's a free phone call, and the phone number is area code 206-202-0582. And so you can just send us uh, a voicemail and we'll get back to you ASAP. Also, if you don't have that capability, you can actually just click a hot link that says uh, record a comment. And then a little window will come up and allow you to actually record uh, a comment or a message to us. And what we love to do is actually in our episodes, play those recorded comments back to all of our viewers to listen to. And also any written emails will also uh, read over our episodes so that others can be blessed by them. 
Also on the right-hand side of the page, a little bit lower, is called Embed This Podcast. And what that means is that you're actually able, say you have your own website or your MySpace or a Facebook or whatever it might be, or your own blog, you can actually get some coding when you click that button, and it will enable you to embed one of our players uh, of our podcast right into your website. And so it'll just automatically show up with all of the podcasts that people can select and a really attractive little player that people can take advantage of and, and play our episodes, our vidcasts, or our audio casts right on there. And also right below that we have subscribe to iTunes and we always encourage people to use iTunes because it's such an easy, user-friendly uh, podcast receiver. Sometimes we call this an, a podcast aggregator. And so there are several aggregators there that you can click on. Find your favorite one that you like to subscribe to podcasts and you can just click it and subscribe to our podcast. And two of our favorite, and I think many people's favorite podcast aggregators or receivers are Juice and iTunes. Juice and iTunes, two different ones. iTunes, probably the most common. And if you don't have that, you can download the software for that either for a PC or for a Macintosh at www.apple.com forward slash iTunes. That's apple.com forward slash iTunes, and you can download that, as I said before, for either a PC or a Macintosh. doesn't matter. Also, another great uh, aggregator for podcasts is Juice, and Juice can be gotten at this URL. It's a little bit more difficult, www.juicereceiver.sourceforge.net. That's juicereceiver.sourceforge.net. And you can download that for free as well. And it also works for either PCs or Macintosh. And finally, what we'd like to ask you to do is think about giving a donation to our podcast. This is done completely as a nonprofit podcast. And so we'd love it if you could help us to continue with this by clicking on our PayPal donation and making a donation. It doesn't matter if it's $5, $10, or $500. It's all going to help us to continue this podcast and to continue giving really good quality content of exciting things that God's doing around the world. So we really uh, would appreciate it if you would make a donation to this podcast so we can continue giving you the, these exciting content. Okay. And so thank you again, and please do remember to come to our website at created.podomatic.com. We're really thankful for what God has done, the fruit that he's brought through Create International over the past 20 years. Not only through the presentations that we've produced and the unreached peoples that have come to Christ, but also in the lives of young people who've worked with us, who've created these presentations and seen their destinies fulfilled in the nations. I love being able to work with video and I love being able to reach the unreached. And I thank God for the opportunity through Create International to do those things by making music videos that are focused on the young generation. I've always had a love for media and technology and so now to combine that with my heart for missions is great. Through the internet, uh, through evangelistic websites, we have a great opportunity to reach out to millions of people worldwide who have never heard of the gospel and I'm so glad to have that opportunity and be a part of it. With Creator International I've been able to combine my passion for filmmaking and for reaching the unreached. I love the nations. And I love doing photography and making documentary films. And I think it's just so cool that in Korea International, I could have the opportunities to channel this passion to reach other peoples. I've had an amazing time over the years training students, both young and old, all generations, to use media to share the gospel with the unreached. Been able to do lots of incredible projects and outreaches in many different countries. In one particular situation in Indonesia, we were working with a Muslim people group and the cast of our film were almost entirely Muslims. But we had the amazing testimony afterwards, after we left, where we heard that the entire cast had actually given their lives to the Lord and had become followers of Jesus. And not only that, but the film itself was widely distributed and has been used by many to share the gospel with the unreached. Side.
Create. 